Media in Johannesburg, this is The Real Economy Report. The Bauma Can Expo Africa 2015 exhibition took place in mid-September at the Johannesburg Expo Center in Nazareth, Kateng, and showcased components and machines for construction and mining, as well as building materials from some of the most prominent brands worldwide. Dylan Stewart attended the expo and filed a story. Balmacon Expo Africa 2015 saw machine and components manufacturers from around the world strutting their stuff and some putting on their dancing shoes to grab the limelight from their competitors. About 14,300 visitors attended the trade show over the four days. This number was lower than the 20,000 visitors originally predicted by event organizers Messe München. The substandard numerical attendance was mainly ascribed to a weak local and global economy. Gauteng MEC for Economic Development, Lebochang Maile, spoke to Crema Media's engineering news about the challenges faced by the economy. The challenges for uh, not just this industry, uh, I think most of our industries, uh, things are, are not going well because uh, globally, as you know, since the recession of 2008, it has been very difficult for countries to um, recover and, 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 and uh, issues about uh, new entry into the market for all the sectors for us is one of the uh, key challenges that we have to look at. Issues about uh, um, access to markets uh, for the new entrants uh, as well, uh, issues of funding for the new entrants. And uh, as a result, the, there has not been a diversification of ownership uh, in the different uh, sectors of the economy. So we're not just worried about this sector of the economy only, we're worried about uh, the different sectors of the economy. Because, like I've said earlier on, that uh, our economy is monopolistic. Uh, very few individuals and uh, multinationals uh, own the biggest stakes in the different sectors of the economy. And for as long as we are not able to um, ensure a, a partnership of the overwhelming majority of our people, we will not uh, fight uh, uh, the triple challenges of poverty, inequality, unemployment. Despite the lower than expected attendance, exhibitors remarked on the quality of the people visiting the show. Maile elaborated on the importance of an event like Bauma. A conference like this is very significant because you've got uh, uh, industry players here, people who are very influential in the industry, people who are uh, part of the industry at the different levels of the value chain. And uh, it's significant because those who want to enter into the industry, want to understand the industries better, they get an opportunity to interact with the real players were here, but to also see what is being displayed here and they learn uh, practically about the, the industry. So this is very important and you also uh, get uh, potential investors as well who want to invest in the country. They are here and if they like what they see, uh, they will uh, invest. Some of them have already invested and they just want to be given uh, assurance uh, that they will be um, uh, uh, continuity uh, in terms uh, and consistency in terms of uh, policies and the creation of a conducive environment. In addition, the expo saw a significant increase in the percentage of foreign visitors from sub-Saharan Africa, with the Democratic Republic of Congo, Zambia, Zimbabwe and Botswana being well represented. Maile himself had met up with some of them. We have uh, met few uh, people who are ministers in their own countries from Zambia, from uh, Germany. Uh, we've got the US uh, representative here. So it's that opportunity as well of tightening up uh, relations with other countries, uh, creating uh, new relations because it's also about uh, being able to interact with the rest of the world to understand what is that they're doing and to build solid relations. So we are very happy that we are, we are able to do that firstly. But secondly, to learn about the industry. Sometimes just to see these uh, equipments and machines, touch them and uh, get an explanation from the um, people who always operate them. It's uh, always um, uh, a good feeling. 
616 exhibitors from 42 countries showcased their new products and innovations. A significant amount of foreign exhibitors came from China, with Germany and Italy also being strongly represented. That's Krima Media's Real Economy Report. Join us again next week for more news and insights into South Africa's real economy.